Pentagram is very popular in modern culture as a symbol of Satanists and evil. But what make pentagram an occult symbol? Note that a pentacle is surrounded by a circle, which makes it different from pentagram. Let's look at the origins. This symbol is more than 5,000 years old. Even during the Stone Age it was carved into the rock for spiritual tenor. Pentagram has been used by ancient Chinese and Japanese to symbolize five elements of life. Fire, earth, metal, water and wood. Ancient Babylonians were also using pentagram to describe different gods and religious beliefs. Even Christians used pentagram to show five wounds of Jesus Christ. Neo-pagans consider pentagram as a symbol of protection and infinity. Until 16th century this symbol often had sacred connotations including its association with the Roman goddess Venus. However, starting from 16th century occultists and mystics as well as esoteric groups such as the Rosicrucians, Freemasonry and the Hermetic Order of the Golden Dawn have made extensive use of the pentagram. There was never any distinction about orientation of the pentagram until self-styled French magician Eliphas Levi wrote a book in which he personally declared it to symbolize evil if pointing down. Following this, in 1897 the French occultist de Guida drew the Sabbatic goat which by 1966 has become associated with Anton Lavi and his Church of Satan, together with Baphomet. Eventhal Levi wanted to represent pentagram as a symbol of absolute, balance and harmony, widespread misinformation turned ancient symbol into symbolism of evil. This I see is exploited even now in many Hollywood horror film industries. The final action by the Church of Satan turned pentagram into infamous symbol of darkness. Of course there is actually nothing wrong with a star and the pentagram itself. It has been used by many cultures until now, even Christianity. You should not fear pentagram and consider it as a symbol of evil. Subscribe and like video to support channel.